Well, good evening, everyone out there, and welcome to the Daily Wrap for what was Monday, the 24th of April, 2023. Wow, what a productive day, and what a supportive day, and what a great day. Let's talk a little bit about the day that was today, shall we? So first of all, on today's Level 1 podcast, we had an outstanding brainstorming session. But before we get to that, I did do a PSA, all right? Sadly, recently, uh, my idiotic stalkers on the internet have tried to basically do everything they can to hurt me for no good reason. I haven't done anything different than normal, but they're just out of their minds and uh, they've been coming after me, hasn't affected me. So now they decided to try to come after my viewers, all right? So today I did a PSA about how to be safe on the internet, to be careful. I feel like sadly some of my viewers have begun to be a little bit lax and uh, some people have told me recently they've actually gotten some harassment as a result of supporting me. So I just want to let everyone know, be aware of what's going on, be careful, don't put out your personal information, etc. If you want to see the full segment, definitely watch the show from this morning, okay? Good news is, most people are alright, and if you just kind of bear with the stupid initial harassment, usually it's not a big deal, but, you know, stands to reason I should bring it up from time to time so people aren't blindsided, alright? Then, <clears throat> today, we had to determine two things on today's podcast. What are we doing Tuesday night? And what are we doing for this special event here on DSP Gaming in the month of May? If you remember, two months ago, it was the Super Bowl event. Early on this month, it was my birthday event. So we talked all about this, and we determined two things. Number one, tomorrow night will be Oblivion with a good reason why. And number two, the special event coming up in May will be a hype for Street Fighter VI launch event, meaning... We're going to do an entire day of Street Fighter-related content. Retro Street Fighter games with challenge runs at high difficulty that the, the, the viewers will control. Um, there's going to be tier maker events regarding Street Fighter, like ranking fighters and characters and games and things like that. There's going to be food related to Street Fighter because I have a Street Fighter cookbook that was donated by viewers, and my wife wants to make some of the recipes for us to try together live in that event. So there will be a very fun Street Fighter-themed hype for Street Fighter VI Marathon. We, we haven't thought of a name of it yet. We're going to start brainstorming a name for it now. But it's either going to be in mid to late May, just a week or two before the launch of Street Fighter VI. So I'm very excited for this. Hope you guys are too. It should be a really great time. And now we can start working towards that and see exactly what we want to do for it. Okay? Maybe I'll even dress up for it. Okay. So anyway... <laughs> We got that figured out, and it was great. It was great because we figured all this stuff out. I was like, oh, I feel good now because now the schedule is all laid out and everything. And uh, we had a chill time with Q&A. It was a good one. Then on the first stream today, it was Elden Ring's second run continuing on. We got a lot done today. What a productive stream. Just listen to this. So we cleared out the eastern part of the Gate of Dectus, the Lift of Dectus, including the Frenzy Tower, the temple over there that had some good stuff and a good spell that I found. Actually, two good spells, I believe. Um... Among other things, we went to the mines and went up the mines that are next to the lift, cleared those out, fought the magma worm, so now we had a good way into the plains, the plateau. We went to the Volcano Manor and started that quest line, cleared out all the area around Volcano Manor, including the giant corrupted tree spirit or whatever it is, which gave us a really good physic flask. Um, or not physic flask, the uh, spirit, the wondrous physic flask, the one that has like, has like a magic buff. Um, kept going down Mount Gelmer, unlocked a bunch of points of grace, unlocked the, the ability to fight optional bosses coming up. We're kind of low level for a few of them. Ended up fighting a bunch, find, found the uh, supposedly the best Glintstone spell in the game, which apparently people are saying is basically the Kamehameha from Dragon Ball, the one that Renala uses on you. We found it. I can't use it yet. I still got a ways to go leveling up my intelligence before I can use it. But we're getting there. And... It's cool that I found it, and then we fought two more optional bosses in that area. So, things went swimmingly today. Did I die a bunch? Yes, I did, but still, this build is great, and I'm actually taking on things relatively soon. I mean, we're only 20 hours into the playthrough. 20. 20 hours into my original run, we were barely doing anything in Lim- in Limgrave. Or, excuse me, in Alirnia. In this run, we are turboing through and just kicking the game's ass with the Glintstone run. So, the Moonvale Blade is great. Pro- the only- you want to know the one thing we didn't do? We didn't find the damn Smithing Stone 5 so I can upgrade the Katana. We found 6, but not 5. So I'm stuck with the thing at level 4. I can't get it any higher level until I find more uh, more, uh, Smithing Stone. But it was a great stream overall, and and it was supportive. 
Everyone seemed to have a really great time. It was a great stream. So I'm actually looking forward to the third and final Elden Ring stream for the week tomorrow, where we're going to continue on. We're probably going to continue to explore the Gelmer region. Maybe we'll go to the plateau and explain the pla explore the plateau area, because I know there's some, some mage towers there as well to check out. Uh, some optional villages and things, optional boss fights. A lot of stuff coming up. So I'm excited for all of this, and uh, it should be pretty neat uh, tomorrow, no matter what we do. All right? And, uh... Then on the night stream tonight, it was Final Fantasy V Pistol, P Pistol, Final Fantasy V Pixel Remaster, and I'm happy to report not only did we make great progress, although this was a harder part of the game. There were some enemies casting like level five death and killing the entire party repeatedly over and over. Man, it was tough, but at the same time, um, it was fun. We had a great time with it, great music, and even though tips were really, really low, everything else was amazing. We had to get this over 100 gifted memberships on the late stream it was insane the amount of support we had on the late stream tonight <clears throat> so wow today supportive day progress in all the games people had tons of fun everything was great i had a great time i hope everyone else did as well i hope you enjoyed the videos tomorrow it will be more elden ring the final of a three-day streak after that elden ring kind of goes on hiatus until much later next week if we even get to play it next week and tomorrow night will be Elder Scrolls for Oblivion, as I already stated. Maybe a little bit more story, but at the, at the very least, I want to start Shivering Isles DLC tomorrow night. All right, guys? So, overall, a great day, great progress, great support, great fun. I really have zero complaints. What a great day today was. Thank you all. Can't wait for tomorrow to end my streaming week, because remember, Wednesday is my day off. So let's have a great, solid end of the week tomorrow. Sound good? All right, guys, thank you so very much. That's all I have. Now, you might be saying, what about the Harry Potter video you said you're going to put out the retrospective? I'm not doing it tonight. I actually have a few other things, uh, personal things I got to wrap up here in the office tonight. I'm going to try to do that for you possibly tomorrow night so you'll have something new to watch over on DSP Reacts before the weekend. Okay? Thank you all. Please have a good night. See you tomorrow. Peace out. Later.